chasing a road to glory driven since i was a child if you want to think bad enough to go out and fight for it work day and night for it hey thursday everybody head to the office here hey grab the garage buddy um running off first eight o'clock have nine o'clock this guy named steven coming from tony robbins gonna be speaking about peak performance uh strategies and then we'll uh have a 10 o'clock a uh, conference call with uh, one of our partners at the corporate office and then uh, 11 o'clock call with uh, the head of uh, distribution and then uh, have lunch with the right guy on uh, take your son to work day and then um, have a two o'clock call um, so let's just go all right so quote of the day is you can't let the phone wait to ring you have to ring them too often people are waiting for opportunity to knock on the door instead of going out proactively and knocking on the door themselves. Good things come to those who work. It's often said that luck is just hard work working in your favor, that the harder you work, the luckier you get. And so if you find yourself not having what you want, great opportunity for you and I to go after what we do want. So be deliberate, be specific, know exactly what you want to go after and start building towards it. Germs out. All right, everybody. Um, end of the day here. Um, great meetings today. Uh, Nine o'clock. Had it with Steve. I'm going to recap some of that in a different video, just because it's going to be a little bit longer. Talking about uh, changing your belief systems. That a lot of times we have limiting beliefs on what we can accomplish, and that's what's holding us back a lot of times. And we might have some emotional stake that's in there at the same time it might be the way that we're viewing things it might be the way that we were raised it might be the way that we've interacted with life and then the other thing um, after that was 10 o'clock was a corporate office uh, uh, training and then at 11 o'clock was a conference call for those in leadership and then at 11 was doing some one-on-one -on -one coaching with the interns Anthony and Sarah uh, role-playing with them phoning language that way they get comfortable I'd rather them make mistakes um, with me in my office before they get, get on the phone and then after that we ended up going to um, Ryan and I grabbed some lunch went to Whataburger um, he saw a gentleman there that was blind outside and um, bought him uh, decided to buy him a, uh, a Whataburger uh, sandwich and then I gave it to him on the way out and then came back to the office. I had a two o'clock call with uh, one of our corporate office partners again uh, from two to 2.45 and then at three with uh, one of my uh, advisors, Kelly, um, with, with again, a corporate office partner on the phone. We were looking at an analysis of his business and what he can do as uh, potential opportunities. And then um, after that, uh, Ryan and I had a quick conversation recapping what Steven from the uh, Tony Robbins uh, coaching team came and talked about and kind of his takeaways and my takeaways. And then um, we got in the car, came out here to the MD Anderson Cancer uh, Center here, uh, ribbon cutting. There was four different chambers of commerce, so had a great time uh, mingling with some um, folks that I know through the Houston West Chamber at the same time, meeting some other folks. So uh, hope you're all doing well. We're now got a, probably an hour and 20 minute drive home. Let's go do it. Woo! Nobody's safe around me.